to use this. Excuse me. Just to wipe your coat, that's... Or... Yeah, go ahead, just take it. Please. Go ahead. It's silly, but it's my favorite coat. I'm sorry. That's vintage. And this part's real suede, so... Now it's ruined. You sure? Maybe, maybe they can fix that. No. I know about stains. It's... You know, I never understood that. I never understood. Live cows get dirty all the time. They don't get stained. All that leather stands in the mud. Nothing happens. Go figure. What is that? Yeah, exactly. Get a little sauce on your coat yeah. and uh -huh. look. Look. Why is that? I don't know. We'll have to ask the next cow that comes by. Handkerchief. Wow. I didn't know they made those anymore. <laughs> uh, I haven't eaten yet. If you haven't eaten yet, maybe we can go and get a bite. Someplace close. I, you know, I saw a, a Chinese over here. We could use chopsticks and, and drop an endless variety of things on our clothes. I'm sorry. I prefer not to socialize with students. Oh. Okay. All right. You know, I shouldn't have taken this from you. I'll, no, I'll buy you a new I, one. Please, I didn't... I didn't mean anything by that. I'll buy you a new one. Excuse me. Mr. Clark, I take dance very seriously. Miss Mitzi's is a school, not a disco. And I hope you didn't join class with me as you go because you'd be wasting your time. Don't dance if that's what you're after. Dance lessons. My husband is taking dance lessons. Well, I've found a lot worse hiding in the potpourri over the years. Consider yourself lucky. Well, what's this, uh, this beautiful young woman? Who's she? He's a substitute teacher. His regular teacher is a much older woman. <clears throat> Great legs, but older. <laughs> See? I, Mr. Devine, what would make a man who's done the same thing for the last 20 years suddenly do something so completely out of character, just, just uh, out of the blue? Uh, that's a question for a shrink. I'm just a detective. Well, I'm not asking you as a detective. I'm asking you as a man. 